you all, my ladies. You are all such strong, beautiful, vicious, vibrant women. Yes. <laughs> How did you all end up married to such boiled potatoes? The custodian of this wonderful raw space is being something of a total harpy in my ass. I'm a man of science. All right, then, Dr. Arsol. How does your science explain what we just saw? There is nothing more devastating than finding out your husband has made porn. And it's so bloody boring. You're a lying piece of old cabbage. How are you supposed to be a strong, thrilling, powerful warrior and lover with a name like Jeff? It is like a weak ejaculation. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Jeff. Okay. You stupid bloody donkey, why did you let me read this for? Bloody fucking Mary, that little piss snake. I don't want these virgins. They are going to taste too sad. That was not a joke. A joke has a punchline. And you wouldn't know a punchline if it ran over your scroll thump with a penny farthing. What are you talking about? These are the wild card. It's the card you get on the top of the deck that has the instructions on it. So you throw it away. Sometimes he can be a giant dipshit with no taste. She used to be such a cute little fresh-faced girl. But now she just looks like an elephant's knee. With the boys being away on this hunting trip with Sean, it is just so <laughs> nice to have the house to myself for a change. This house, it can be a lot of male energy. Oh, I mean, duh. Sometimes you just gotta call out with your ladies, have a proper female fuckabout. Oh, 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 I have an idea. What? Let's watch Mamma Mia. Uh, yes. Mamma Mia is my favorite, favorite film to watch when I am missing my homeland. But Laszlo never lets me watch it. He says, my darling, I can't watch that. It reminds me of all the bastard children I fathered when I was a human. So when you hear me, darling, can you hear me? S.O.S. The love you gave, very yes. <laughs> This dynamo needs a top up, so uh, I'm gonna go and get one. Anyone else? No, I'm good. No. You want me to pause it or? No, no don't mind. Only be a moment. The love you gave me, nothing else. Please don't wear that hat. Too stylish? No. It's a big bloody stupid hat with a big bloody stupid curse on it. And every time you wear it, something bloody stupid terrible happens. Wait, what happened? I thought you were gonna change. I couldn't find anything else to wear, Guillermo. Just leave it. Okay, okay, it's fine. You look great. How am I supposed to go to work looking like this? Can't you just change into another of your beige suits? I swear I am going to rip that man into shreds and make a dress out of it and go to his family's house and say, do you like this? This is your son and I'm wearing him as a dress. We don't have any clothes. They are all soiled. We cannot go dressed like this. It is pretend. Keep your perm on. This is all very stupid. Not to mention that we are the leaders of the Vampiric Council. We're going to be a laughing stock when they found that you've gone crying off to go and play human dress up. How's this for the city? Oh, yes. You look like a beautiful piece of wallpaper. I have something I need to tell you. OK. I don't think you should wear that helmet because it's going to make absolutely no difference when the sire is crushing you and mincing you to smithereens. Hello, cheeky little one. Out having some fun, are we? Uh, not really. Oh, no. Are those little dog shits not giving you the deep respect you deserve? Yeah. Let's walk and talk about what the future could be like for the new Diana. Unleash the power, yes, exactly, yes. You're saying that would help me su seduce men? And destroy them. <laughs> and the women, too. Mm. Oh, hello. Who's this, Guillermo? The maid. I'm Nacho of Antipaxos. I'm rich now, so I have. Have a maid. It's tu novia, no? Oh. See, see your yeah. girlfriend. Isn't that right, Naja? You're both my girlfriend and my maid. Why? It all started actually when my mom was trying to set me up with her church friend's niece, and just to get her off my back, I'd said I was dating Naja. Naja, acompáñanos. Sí. Join us. Yes. Uh, okay. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> Guillermo, your girlfriend was here this whole time and you didn't invite her to eat with your family? Yes, Guillermo can be a little bit of a big rotten shitbag. Yeah. <laughs> Te amo shitbag? Yeah. One of my many sweet little cheeky pet names oh. for him. Yeah, Silly bitch, where have you gone? Stop being so dramatic, you stupid bitch. I love you so much. Of course we love you, you stupid bitch. My lovely bitch, we've got you. I love this little slut. I just really want to open up a 
jumping at nightclub. I mean, come on. It's a no-brainer. This is my club, everyone, just so you know. I'm Nadja, and it's called Nadja's. It's my club! <laughs> People think that the Vampire Nightclub is just a 24-hour live suck and fuck fest that prints money, but it is not. Are there any vampires in this motherfucking dungeon who want to see Richie so What can I say? The nightclub has really taken off recently. Nadja's has become the hotspot for the tri-state area vampire community. I love you like a sister, baby, you know it. But even if you even think about damaging my brand, I will cut you in two!